Welcome to Simple Helix. This is our customer entrance to our data center. Only existing customers have a key fob to enter the data center. At this point, you've went through our main entrance security protocol and you've now entered our first man trap. In this room, clients have space to have a cup of coffee, meat, and whiteboard out solutions. You can also tell your friends you got to work with R2-D2. Yes, that's a real movie prop from Star Wars. Nobody was better at protecting important data than R2-D2. Now let's move on to our second man trap in our biometric security. You've scanned your key fob four times and our 24-7 arm guard has verified you are who you say you are. And to go forward, you must use your key fob again and look into our iris scanner to unlock our turnstile. This is not an ordinary turnstile like at a hotel entrance. This turnstile monitors individual heartbeats, making sure that one person can pass through at a time. You could try to sneak an extra person in, but it's gonna get awkward really quick. Well, we'll also have some video for you to share at your company Christmas party. As you can see, we take securing your data seriously and we're not done yet. Now we're in our network operations center. Here we monitor our network, but we can monitor the health of your environment as well with our SOC services. The screen in front of you would normally have important data, but keeping with our secure facility concept, we can't show you. But we can tell you that we monitor data from 18,000 points on site every two seconds. We watch all internet traffic coming in and out of the data center. Plus we manage our 88 miles of fiber in Huntsville. We stay on top of the weather 24 seven. We built this data center to be one of the most resilient facilities in North Alabama. Now let's move into our data hall, talk some more. This pod would survive a direct hit from an F5 tornado. We are a 2N plus 1 design. That means we have three ways of doing everything. Two utility feeds that feed two generators that feed two UPSs. Most people don't do this. Number one, it's expensive. Number two, outside of Washington, D.C., we have the most government contractors in the U.S. They can't go down, so we can't go down either. We use a hot cold aisle method for cooling our racks. This makes us more efficient. We have a 1.5 power usage effectiveness rating, or PUE. Look at it like the gas mileage for your car. We use less energy to operate. We can all agree that fire and water damage would be devastating to the server room at your work. Well, it would also be devastating to our data center as well. Our Novak fire system is the best on the market to protect your data. Some data centers actually still use water to put out fire around electronics. I'll pause for a second to let that soak in. Our systems put out the fire with gas that is environmentally approved not to hurt us, the equipment, or the environment. But like what we do with everything else here at Simple Helix, we take it a step further. We use our FAST system to monitor the air of our data center on a molecular level. We know about 45 seconds before a fire starts. We get an email notification telling us we need to dust. The FAST system is like your mom on steroids. We treat your data as if it was our children. To what price or procedure would you agree to protect your children? This is our cloud aisle. You can use AWS or Azure, but if you need to know where your data is located, well, you're looking at it. Our clouds consist of Nutanix and VMware with a Veeam backup solution. It can also be replicated in Atlanta. Everything you've seen so far is state of the art, but would be useless without a cutting edge power and cooling infrastructure. We have two complete chillers, both A and B, with two compressors under each chiller, and any one compressor can handle the entire cooling of our data hall. This is one of our power halls. It provides both A and B conditioned power through our UPSs, backup power from our generators, and backed up by our dual utility feeds. We have five generators on site, providing four and a half megawatts of emergency power. Behind this stands 16,000 gallons of diesel fuel. Another thing that we do that is unique is we clean our fuel three times a week to remove water. Because of the humidity in Alabama, we will remove as much as 10 gallons in a three month period during the summer. The moment we need the fuel, we'll not know the moment before. The equipment yard is surrounded by a K4 fence, which brings a 15,000 pound vehicle going 30 miles an hour to a complete stop. I hope you've enjoyed this brief tour of our tier three data center. We've covered a lot, but there's a lot left to cover. Hopefully this has generated more interest for discussion in person or via web meeting. Let us take care of your data from the keyboard to the cloud.